Hey guys, today we're gonna review this The Batman Arkham Origins Joker Here's a close up of the face Now, I don't have the packaging of this because I got the 4 pack with Deathstroke, Batman, Black Mask and Joker so I don't have the packaging but I already throw the four pack packaging so yeah sorry for not so many new packaging that's but the packaging is just like the others but it's square it's rectangular and it's just showing you the toys on the back and yeah let's get to the review so this is it this is joker he stands about like six inches like that and he has pretty nice details and sculptings. And let me show let me show you the color that of the hair. Oh that's the hair. Nice black washing there. There is some spiky hair here, so be careful. It's rubbery but it's still pretty sharp. And his face He has like green eyebrows, <laughs> that's funny. And then here is his suit. And under you can see some yellow washing there. There is the back side of Joker. You can do this, look at that. You can't really get it out, the jacket. And he's wearing some yellow on the inside and a green vest. And he has black pants and gloves and black shoes. So yeah, the only thing I don't like quite like is he doesn't come with any accessories or any of the, any of those. And I've noticed that the Batman also have no accessories, but when you buy the four pack, he uh, he has his grapnel gun. So yeah, his collectibles isn't really caring about their the accessories because they're just doing it that because of the. details and paint ups on this thing and be very careful of this because you might break their joints because it's pretty fragile i broke batman's arm but i fixed it just glue it still moves and speaking of moving let's talk about the articulation you can the head is on the ball joint you can do this, this, up and down, rotate 360, then you can, oh, the head can go down that far and up that far only, and you can rotate the arms 360. You can bend the elbow only like that, single jointed, and you can do it like that if you want. And you can rotate the wrist, the same on the other side. You can rotate the waist. You can move the feet up like that, up forward, and then back like that, far, and then you can 
bend at the knee. Single jointed. You can you can slightly an do an ankle pivot here, but it's not really an ankle pivot. There's no joint there. It's just it's wiggly, so you can do that. And that's pretty much for the articulation. Again, this figure is not really just a figure. It's more of a collector's piece because it it's not so good for playability. Because number one, the joints are fragile. And number two, the articulation is just okay, but not for playing. It's just for collecting and you can put him in many dynamic pose but there's it's not really that dynamic because he has only a few points of articulation and he doesn't have accessories but she's still a great figure and this has been my review of the Joker from Batman Arkham Origins from DC Collectibles and hope you guys like it please like subscribe comment on what you want next and about the the video that I uploaded yesterday um the one that I told you, the little one, the little Lego set, kind of, is, I, I've built it already, but my camera, I mean my computer, isn't uploading it to YouTube, so I'm just gonna find a way, but it will be a long time, but please, um, and yeah that's all i have to say and hope you guys like it bye